Oh my fins, everyone. I have to tell you about the imposter I ran into in New Jersey. His name was Sean, the summer flounder. Summer flounder are nicknamed the chameleons of the sea since they are capable of changing their color to blend in with the texture and color of the bottom of where they live. Can you believe he was pretending to be me? Everyone knows I'm the real flounder. Okay, I'm getting a little sidetracked. Back to finding Ariel, New Jersey and New York, Addie Cornell. Hi there. My name is Sugar Tree, and I'm the state tree of New York, best known as a sugar maple. I am popular for my spectacular fall foliage, ranging from yellow to orange to red each year. Not to brag, but I contain the sweetest sap of all the maple trees, which is used to make maple syrup and maple sugar. Wait a second, you all remind me of a girl I met not too long ago. Her name was Addie, and she had a title that I was stumped by. It was something about music and, oh yes, New Jersey and New York. Speaking of New Jersey, that's where I met Addie. She was here visiting New Jersey Rainbow's Love Yourself 84th Grand Assembly. She told me that their motto was courage is the first step to being seen. Their mascot was Merida and their symbol was mirrors. Addie was jumping up and down when she learned that they were celebrating 100 years of New Jersey Rainbow. That's almost half my age. She went on and on about how they were raising money for Shriners Children's Hospital, which was the Grand Worthy Advisors Service Project this year. Grand Charity holds a ball every year to help support this project. This ball dates back to the 1980s. Their theme was out of this world time warp and they had make your own mac and cheese. That sure shook my branches. Addie was so delighted to learn that they exchanged swaps and have a Grand Officer of the Year Award. She loved to hear the grand soloist sing during special escort and watch the grand representatives do a costume parade as they shared information about their rep states. She also learned about something called Grand Officer Days, when the grand officers hold an initiation and have a small lunch for girls from all assemblies. That sure sounds like a fun way to turn a new leaf. Addie thought it was treetastic when she met New York's Grandworthy Advisor at New Jersey's convention and she learned that New York Rainbow's theme is One Friendship Can Change the World with Mascots Hiccup and Toothless. They even have a challenge to take a picture with Toothless at every event they go to this year. That sure tickled my leaves. Addie was interested to learn that the state charity of New York is selected by the Junior Grand Executive Committee, which is made up of girls from across the state. This year, they are supporting the Ronald McDonald House Charity by decorating coffee cans like little houses to help collect money for donation, which I think is great because money doesn't grow on trees. Addie's hoping to visit New York's 83rd Grand Assembly sessions in the first weekend of April. I sure wish I could pick up my roots and join her. Oh dear, I can feel the wind changing and rustling my leaves. I better go. It was lovely to talk to all of you. If you see Addie, give her a New Jersey rainbow. Hello, Addie. Hello, Addie. Sugar Tree says hello. Hi, thank you.